This video will explain how to do a keyword search on Craigslist for a particular term. And in this example, we're going to use the keyword Toyota Prius. Now, I have the option here to search for the exact phrase, to search for a negative keyword, to search for Toyota Prius and maybe uh, Nissan Altima with the OR button, or to search for a group of keywords. So for this example, we could click the OR button and then also look for a Nissan Altima at the same time. But to keep things simple, we are just going to, for this example, just search for the Toyota Prius. Now, I also have the option to check these boxes here. I can search for listings on Craigslist that has an image. Uh, I can search for only the instances of Toyota Prius in the search titles. Or I can only search in category listings. But right now we're going to leave these all blank. Let's go ahead and left click on the keywords here to collapse the box. The keyword, when we do this, will remain intact. Now we just left click on the locations box. We're going to look for a location in Los Angeles. So, if I were to click the United States here, as you can see by hitting this left triangle right next to the United States, everything in the United States will be searched. So there's no need in this circumstance to check the main country. All we're going to do is go down to our state, and if you, again, select the triangle to the left of the state here, it'll expand it out and we're going to go for Los Angeles. Now as you can see Los Angeles has a triangle next to it which means it can be expanded but we're going to search for all of Los Angeles so I'm going to click the box there and just I'm going to show you what happens when we click this triangle you're going to see that all the areas in Los Angeles are auto-filled. Alright so again by left clicking these triangles we can collapse and recollapse the boxes. So now if I left click on the location, it's going to recollapse the box. And we're going to move to the categories by left clicking on it. So here I can search for any of the categories on Craigslist. I'm going to click for sale. And I'm going to search for all the cars and trucks. Because in this case, it doesn't matter to me if I'm looking for a Toyota Prius that is sold by the dealer or by the owner. So I'm going to click this box here. And if I was looking for a particular book, or health product, or bicycle, I would just check the appropriate boxes. But in this case, we're only looking for Toyota Priuses for sale. I'm going to left click the box to collapse it, and I'm going to select the for sale option here. Now I'm not looking for Toyota, any Toyota Prius that is over $14,000. Let's just say that's my budget. So I enter that in this box. If I had a minimum budget, I would enter it here. So in this case, I would be searching for Toyota Prius between $5,000 and $14,000. But for the sake of this example, we're going to keep it simple and we're just going to list any Toyota Prius that is less than $14,000. I'm going to left click and collapse it. I'm going to hit the MISC button and I can search from a date range. So if I wanted to search for a uh, posting that is a week old, uh, three days old or just a day old I can do so. In this case I'm gonna click the autofill with today's date. This is gonna select the from date and the to date to be today's date because now I'm only searching for a Toyota Prius in Los Angeles that was posted today. And we're gonna select the applicable boards that I wanna search and in this case I only wanna search Craigslist now I'm gonna click search and we're gonna wait for the results as you can see results immediately start popping up and the more boards you search at once the longer the search will take naturally and that is how you do a particular uh, general search on the classified searcher now that we have our results for the Toyota Prius search Let's suppose I wanted to make another similar search. The easiest way to do that would be to right click on the untitled search we just created, 
that had the keyword of Toyota Prius. We're going to right click on this tab and select clone search. Now this is going to keep all of the categories intact. The keyword will be the same as you can see. The location is the same as you can see. It's still searching LA. The category is the same. As you can see, it's still searching all the cars and trucks. And the price is the same. So let's say that instead of searching just for a Toyota Prius, we also wanted to do a Nissan Altima. But in this case, we would be willing to only pay $10,000 for a Nissan Altima. So we would go to the For Sale options. We change this $14,000 to a $10,000. And we just click Start Search. So now we've just run two searches. Uh, one which is cloned upon the other search. And it's just that easy.